We're in the South Shore neighborhood on the south side today doing a full house full of clothes, a clothes clutter clean out. I think there's 10,000 pieces of clothes all over the basement. Mostly just clothes. I had to put salt on the floor so the low won't freeze at the bottom of the truck today. We're in the South Shore neighborhood, South Side of Chicago. Go up there as we go. South Shore of Chicago today doing a closed clutter cleanup. I was just updating them as we go today. And we might have to come back tomorrow. The whole base is going to close. Several thousand pieces of clothes. Sitting in the South Shore today. Order clean out. Thousands of uh, clothes. This is kind of like a clothes order. And we're going to pack it in. PhD. The whole idea is to give the customers as much as money's worth. Back in truck time. We'll update as we go. So we're in South Shore today. We just cleared this little area. It was piled about six foot tall with clothes. Clothes were everywhere. And we made a pathway now. So we moved the truck to the alley. It's one advantage of having a dumpster on wheels. We can move it from front to back of the house. We're going to be working on the garage now. I'm sorry, we're going to be working on the basement. It's full of clothes. About 5,000 pieces of clothes. We're going to bag it up and stack it up high. And we're updating on South Shore, South Side of Chicago this morning. It was a clothes hoarding, clothes hoarding cleanup. And we're coming up on 35 yards or so. With our bags, we're able to use the space up really tight in the truck. And uh, we're just updating our work. Now we're in the basement. Just more, thousands of pieces of clothes coming out today. Too much is never enough. Another update today, we're coming up on 38 cubic yards, we're in South Shore today. Our scientific packing utilizes the uh, most different truck space. Without bagging this stuff up, we didn't get as much junk in the truck, we didn't bag it. The bags uh, fit everything really tight in the truck. Yards. Oh, <laughs> and we're at about 45 yards. It's been a real tough flow. It's all garbage cans and all clothes. So it's all bags and cans, and that's the toughest load we get. They're just so hard to pack. We're only good for one a day on one of these. Uh, we'll be coming back tomorrow morning, I believe. We're in South Shore, Chicago. Alright, so now we're, we uh, shut the halfway door, we're going to top it off. 10,000 bags of clothes. Anyone. And then another, uh, is another load or two? Like two loads. Some say one, some say one and a half, some say two. I think two. All right, well, I'll have to look to take a walk down there in a minute. There's just so many closets. Yeah, hidden drug, hidden rubbish. And they all full. The hidden, yep. Okay, I'll switch up to the So we got a good chunk of this. Basement done. There are a couple of hidden rooms here. This closet goes way back. It's way, way back. Way back. That's about a 20 foot closet. It goes way back. What do you think, Matt? At least another load? Yeah. Updating, uh, we're uh, going to wrap it up here. Really giving the customer the, the best we can pack it. And we're on South Shore today. 
today was a big load of junk. I want to just uh, document how much we got in this dumpster. 50 yards of quarter loads today.